Okay. Now, let's do some eclipse, shall we? Uh, we'll just do Captain as a warm up. We got a shrine of chance right here. That's two three items right away. Uh, basically dead weight items. Fantastic. Fucking hell. Two items. I got two items at a shrine of chance or three. And neither of them do anything. On the other hand, when I spend 25 cash for a, a small chest, you know, then it's like the most broken attack item in the game. Alright, sweet. Good start, good start. Uh, let's see here. What kind of runner are you? I can't see from up here. Tougher times? You know what? This sounds a hell of a lot better than a teddy bear. Or, yeah, that, that is a teddy bear. That sounds a hell of a lot better than a bison steak. That's what I meant to say. Alright. Gimme, 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 gimme. Alright, I forgot that fall damage is doubled and lethal now. Gotta remember that. Okay, let's see here. Money, money, money! Oh, we got another chest up here. War banner. I don't mind a war banner. War banner's okay. And we got a healing chest right here. Good, good, good. Topaz brooch! Now that's always an item I can get behind. Topaz brooch is like a free pass to get through stage one, man. Everything dies so easily, you just can't help but stack shield. Let's hit this. Radar, huh? A lot of people don't like the radar, but I actually don't really mind it that much. Okay, so we have chest way up there by the teleporter, and then it looks like three chests over there. Now I know exactly where to go. See, it's actually really helpful for, like, stages one and two. Especially for characters that don't have as much mobility as other characters, so... It, it's it's really like almost necessary to just make sure you know exactly where you're going so you don't waste any time. It looks like a large chest, so that's what we'll pop our uh, beacon on. Definitely grabbing a gasoline. It's just a super, it, again, it's a super nice way to make sure stage one goes by really nice and easy. A broken watch, or delicate watch, okay. And we got resonance disc out of this guy, out of this bad boy. All right. Let's grab the healing drone up here. Just for microbots, more than anything else. 
we'll hit that Void Cradle and then call it a day. By the way, if you are watching, please do comment. I love chatting while I play. It's like most of the enjoyment I get out of streaming. And it's really hard to chat when you're just by yourself. In fact, people call you insane for talking to yourself. I know from experience. Alright. Let's do this. Bring it on, Stone Titan. Okay, come on over. Come on over. Uh, it's time to get behind cover. And, uh, there it is. And we got a Neural Wall. I actually... Don't mind the neural. Like, it's not the greatest boss item out there, but it's better than a lot of greens, just because the base regenerate is really nice. And I'm not quite at the point yet where all my healing is halved, so... I, uh, yeah, I really don't mind it. Stage 1 Resonance just that. It's a, it's a really good start. And we're actually through here relatively quickly as far as uh, as my stage ones go. Like, I'm pretty sure we hit fucking everything. It's a shrine of chance we missed, but, you know, it was worth it for the resonance disc. Uh, this is looking good. Alrighty. Stage two. Cleansing pool and plenty of void cradles. Let's see if maybe we can find some lunar pods as well. Gotcha. There we go. That's three. That's mostly just the Marians. That's two left. We're gonna, we're gonna just go through. Oh wait, no, I can't jump down there. Fuck. This will take a whole bunch of fall damage. <laughs> there you guys are. If you don't mind, if you could just die real quick. Damn, these things can jump. Why can't I jump that high? Now, I really don't want to have to come back up here later. Where the fuck are you guys going? Oh, I got one. Ugh. I just... I just want my damn chests. Oh, this is, that's definitely high enough of a fall that it would kill me. Alright, let's hit the, uh... Ooh, more saver spaces. Alright, well, something killed it and it cleared out, so we'll take it. I just kind of walked away and it, it, uh, it worked. Void Sunk Flame. 
Oh my god, please, for the love of god, die! Uh, these things are so hard to hit. Got it. Alright, Jesus Christ, we can finally move on. getting into oh miss oh more Winston Plank cool. I'm a big fan of Winston Plank and oh my god four came out of this one Polly loot yep we'll take that Two voids and planes and a polylude. This is uh, going pretty well. I mean, I'm definitely going to be going through the stage slowly, but right. we have enough damage items that, that it doesn't matter. <laughs> Ooh, repulsion plate, that's really important. God, I love the music in this game. Yeah, my, uh, my brilliant, perfectly on-key singing voice is, I'm sure, just blowing you guys away. Yeah, there were no chests over there. That entire, like, side of the map was basically just wasted time. I, I could have known that easily had I just fucking scanned. Wow! Everything is over there on that corner. Yeah, okay, I should have scanned. <laughs> Especially the character this slow. I literally should have just scanned. <laughs> Ugh, this song's great. Ah, we got an oddly shaped opal. So now we got double bubble protection, as I like to call it. Let's just take the shortcut up there. And there really actually wasn't that much on this map. There was, like, a four void cradles in that one void seed, and then, like, fuck all for the entire rest of the map. Gorag's Opus, I mean, it's it's better than Radar Scanner. More Tri-Tip! More Gasoline! All things I can get behind. And a Hopo Feather, nice! I can mitigate fall damage now. That's important. Oh my god, I hate these things! Die, oh my god. And we have to end this here before it comes back down? Okay. Woo! That was a lot closer than I would have preferred. Uh, because fuck Clay Templars, am I right? Yeah, Residence Tits, that's what I'm talking about.
good resonance disc. The game's just playing itself right now. Oh my god, man. I, those two Clay Templars just about had me there. <laughs> Good wrestling's disc. Oh, good job, fireworks. You guys are really accurate. Yeah, let's just use this for the movement speed right now. We got another cleansing pool, but no lunar pods. I swear, like, the, I, it sometimes it feels like the game is programmed to just not drop any lunar pods on any map with a cleansing pool. I could have gotten both of those items. I'm sad now. Yeah, give me more safer spaces. That's what I like to see. Renault Band. Yeah, I straight up could have just gotten both of those. I'm very saddened. Okay, so I can apparently activate. Oh, it's because Woods and Flame. Yeah. Woods and Flame activates uh, bands. Good to know. I don't really mind that too much. It just means I have to be careful uh, who I shoot when I uh, pop it down in Diablo Strike. No biggie. Alright. What do you got for me today, Void Cradle? Wongus. Game has given me like all of the best fucking Void items that are just strict upgrades. Today's a good day. Alright. Oh, we got a large chest here. We're just going to drop the beacon, because there's no guarantee there's more shrines of chance on the map. It's better to use them to lose. Warhorn! Oh, can buy a Gorex Opus? So I'm going to have some crazy attack speed. It's a key cruncher. Hmm. Tempting, tempting. Yeah, we'll grab a key. Why not? Oh, it took my repulsion plate. I regret everything. Oh, and there's the Shrine of Chance, but it's okay, I have like 900 cash now, I should be able to just buy it out just fine. Uh, one more. No, we're gone. <laughs> Another Void Cradle we can crack. Good god, man, this game has just been giving us a shit ton of Void Cradles today. Well, now we have two keys, and we have three total stages left, so we better be good at finding these, and the void items better be good. Captain gives no shits about your void, about your void defense. Alright, alright, what do we got here? Armor piercing round! Yes, please! 
Give me like 10 more of those. Oh, yeah, give me more voids in flame too, yeah. Fucking hell, man. Alright, let's hit the boss. Oh god, holy attack speed. <laughs> wow! Gorex Opus and Warhorn together may give you quite the attack speed boost. Okay. Unfortunately, we got Squid Pile off, which is basically just Scrapper Fuel. Go away, no, no, go away. Yeah, good boys, good boys. Look at the radius on that. It was huge. Oh, oh, yep, thank you, Resonance Disc. Alright, we're gonna be getting a red item, at least one more red item next stage, so uh, that'll be good. Unless it's Siren's Call, because I actually don't know if I have the capability to fight the Aloy Worship unit. Of course it's fucking Siren's Call. You know what? Let's let's wait on this one. Maybe see if we can find a key and come um, uh, like a, a mom's credit card and come back. Cause that's such a good like green tri shop there. And if I can find a, a credit card, the executive card, that'll make me a very happy person. Plus, I'm still- I, I am looking to replace my Gorex Opus. Unfortunately, I don't think I'm gonna go for the Aloy Worship unit this time around. It is just... I think a little bit too tanky for the damage that we can pull right now. I didn't get lucky and find any, uh... Printers this time for, for tri-tips or anything. Oh my god, fucking Larva! Ah! I fucking hate Laura. It's so hard to hit. Okay, new void item. What are we getting? Oh, I don't have 50% HP, even though I do have the shield. Pretty much all the healing I'm going off of right now is, um... Just the neural. More safer spaces, alright. Cool, I, I'll take it. I like safer spaces. Safer spaces are good spaces. Uh, what did I get from that large chest? Oh, was it another hobo? I think it was another hobo. Right. Again, these are things that I would really like to have an executive card for, because this are really, really good. Ooh. Actually, Gorex Opus is kind of the perfect equipment to give to an equipment drone, because it's not something that scales with, like, the caster's items. It just makes everybody scale with their items. So that's something I can just give to an equipment drone and have constantly activate. Only thing is now Warhorn won't activate because I don't have an equipment of my own. 
Oh hey, there's the tri tip printer. I guess we can go for the the big bad. I'd love to find a scrapper before we before we start that. Reaching seed. Not the greatest item in the universe, but hey, we'll take it. Gasoline. Same thing, basically. Uh, we can't hit any more eggs until we actually print. So let's, let's print so that we can hit our eggs. Here's the printer. We're just gonna cap it out. Oh god, just stay in the air. Oh my god, this place is just a larva hell. took the armor piercing rounds. That's one thing I definitely would have preferred keeping. And same with the glasses. I was hoping it would just keep taking gasoline. War banner, I don't mind using. It's not gonna be useful against Mithrix. There, that's ten. Alright. Cat's bleed. I don't think we're gonna get our hands on an executive card. But, just to be on the safe side, let's head down to the bottom first to see if we can find any equipment barrels. Then we'll loop back around to the top after taking care of the Aloy Worship unit and grab those tri shops that we passed by. I'm just glad it didn't take too many like oh, I don't think it took any actually. Alright, what do you got for me? Yeah, large, lots of large chests today. Unfortunately, guillotine is not useful against Mithrix. Kane just You're gonna have gasoline and you're gonna like it. <laughs> hey, alright, here's our uh, our encrusted key. Uh, we're just gonna get more teddy bears. Alright, time to hit the, uh, Aloy Worship unit. Alright, Mocha! I like Mochas. Let's grab a Predator's Instincts. We can use some more attack speed. We can always use more attack speed. I know we don't really have that many glasses, but you know or not, that could change. We don't really need capped crit, we just need enough crit that it activates, and that consistently, and with Captain's attack speed, you know, it only takes a couple of glasses. One or two. But damn, where are the rest of these? Uh. Thanks. I'm actually kind of perplexed. I don't know where these things are. I feel like I should have encountered a few of them by now. Is that a teddy bear burner? I didn't even notice that. It is a teddy bear burner. Oh, here's one. Alright, we got a fresh delicate watch. We broke our old one. Distant whirring. Okay, one more. Come on. Give me something. Nothing up here, really. Okay, fine. Oh, whirring grows loud. It hit somewhere.
I don't give a shit about your shield. Goodbye. Alright, what do we get here? Brilliant Behemoth! Amazing! That's what I'm fucking talking about. Alright. Boss time. Magma Worm? Ha! You got nothing. Good sir, you are now aware of my greatness now that you are dead. Molten Perforator! Pretty mixed bag of items this time around. Some of them are just fucking amazing, and then others, uh, not so much. Overall, I'd say it's a pretty solid run back. Lots of single target. Molten Perforator is one of those items, though, that's like... It can be really good, but... In Mythrix is a very much so a 1v1 fight. And uh, is not necessarily as suited to it. But you know what? I'd gladly take the Molten Perforator over with like tons of other green items. So, you know, happy day. We got capped out bleed daggers now, so we're just gonna just be a bleed machine against Mithrix. Although we don't have any kind of armor piercing rounds, which is a bit of a shame. We also don't have any crowbars. The bands. The band problem we can solve right now. Oh no, I think we do have a band, right? Yeah, we have one Kiara's band, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we do. Okay, I see it. Ah, shit. All right, big guy, come on. Lead to death. There you go. Good boy. Okay. That gives us pretty much all the cash we need. So let's go looting. ATG, ATG, there we go. Alright, this is gonna be a pretty solid Mythrix run. We just have to fucking make it to him. More Hopo feathers. 20 more of those and I can no filler Mythrix. <laughs> a new pillar skip. Hardly think that's that's an achievable goal though. Hey, it's the repulsion plate we lost! Awesome! You always want at least a couple of those bad boys. Hello, you distinguished gentlemen of treasure chests. Yes, glasses, that'll help go with our uh, player's instincts that we picked up. And now we can go back here and hit the Renault's band. We do need some crowbars, though. Crowbars would be really, really helpful. Ooh, ooh, shine on the mountain. Yes, sir. I'm actually out of cash. We should go back and kill those dudes. Oh no, they fell off the cliff. It's okay. Alright, that resonance just kicked them. I'm not sure which one. But in either case, it worked out for us. So yeah.
Shrine of Chance. Shrine of Chanceless because it's free. Hey, Harvester Side. 20% crit. Okay, we can consistently proc our, uh, our Predator's Instincts now. Awesome. Longus. You mean Longus, good sir. And, uh, we got another, uh, impressive key. Speaking of, I have one somewhere on the map. Uh, no. Normally, Ceremonial Dagger is fantastic, but I don't have a Forgive Me, please. And I also have a Brilliant Behemoth, so... I think we'll take the Brilliant Behemoth. Because without a forgive me, please, ain't no way ceremonial backers is gonna be useful against my boots. Alright, teleporter's right below us. So let's go and loot a little bit. Know where we need to go back to. No good sir. Thank you for the bison stay. Oh, damn it. Am I really not gonna find any damn equipments? Like seriously. I've been with like five stages and I found a total of one equipment and gave it to an equipment girl. Are you fucking kidding me? It's Sky Meadows. There's always equipment here. What the hell? Uh, no, we're not trading. We're not trading needle tip. <laughs> uh, we'll just get more longus. Man, there are like legitimately just no equipments. None. Like straight up. How the fuck do you just not have any equipment barrels for four stages? On Sky Meadows, too. The low probability of this is just absurd. Hey, more glasses, though. Okay, I really, really want an equipment, so let's do a little bit of extra running, just to see if we can find one. Let's check the outskirts here, there's, there's often like one or two overlooked items here. Alright. Uh, we'll check the bottom side. Like, fucking anything would be better than nothing. Uh, nope, we, there's just nothing. Alright, I have no equipment going into Mithrix. Fucking fantastic. Alright. I, I heard that Lunar Coin drop. Let's go. No point, no sense wasting any more time. Let's just hit the boss. With any luck, it'll give me like two more ATGs or some shit. I think it totally travels through walls. Not that I mind. No, fuck your Sonic Flare or Solar Flare. And goodbye. Easy peasy. We got Planula and Warhorn. Shame, I have like two Warhorns and no fucking equipment. Okay, you know what? Everything's gonna be like lit up now, so let's let's item search. It'll be even easier to spot them now. 
would be for just any kind of red player. Any kind of red player. There's something way over there. Two things over here. Three things over here. Equipment? No, one of them's a Shrine of Combat. We know we ain't hitting that. Alright, one, two chests. Healing drone. Drone. Shit, dude. There's just fuck all. Alright. We're not going all the way over for those two chests, so we're just gonna come back and uh, complete the teleporter and get the gone. got this though. I think we can handle Mithrix now in the The pillars, it, it, we're not gonna be able to do any kind of pillar skipping though. Or wait, maybe we could considering we're captain. <laughs> yeah, we can do a pillar skip if we're careful enough. Let's do it. I even have safer spaces so I can guarantee it won't do any damage to me, at least for the... At least unless, as long as I'm not shot. Yeah, we're gonna do the Captain Pillar skip on stage four Eclipse. Cause fuck those. That's why. I have four jumps if it's not good enough. Do this. Ain't nothing left to do but go for the boss. I didn't get any wax pills this whole time either. Alright, well, I'm definitely not going to just one shot his first phase like I'm used to with Captain. Uh, just because I never got any any crowbars, so the three bands isn't gonna be enough with our Diablo strike. But it'll still do a hefty chunk to him. Good music, man. Always gets to me. Yeah, we can totally go skip this. We do need to get rid of that wisp before we do so, though. Well, that worked. That's a perfected elite. Okay. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Fucking hell. Perfected Elite Lunar I swear to god, man, every time I do an Eclipse run, the Lunar Chimera Wisps are the death of me. And it's always just some one random Perfected Elite that I can't kill before time runs out. <sighs> Shit. And once they start hitting you, you can't avoid them because they just stagger you into, into more hits. 
most ridiculous enemy. That's upsetting. Alright, well, that was our warm up. Let's do, uh, let, let's just beam it with Sawblade Multi. Yeah, baby. Double saw blades on Eclipse. Let's go. All right, we got a good amount of cash. We need to get some items, though, before we just get overloaded by wisps. Double Sawblade Multi is, uh, um, not the greatest wisp killer in the world, as one might expect. And if you don't get an item to deal with wisps, then uh, you're basically screwed. <laughs> so he is definitely a, at least a little bit RNG-based in the beginning of the game. If I can find a repulsion plate, then I should be... Okay-ish, though. Shipping request on stage one. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's like five extra items before Mythrix. got in here? Fireworks! Those will help deal with wisps to a degree. Yeah. Alright, the eyelid's inaccessible. That's good. Alright. This, uh, this is looking good so far. I have at least a temporary measure against Wisps, and I have a shipping request for him on stage one. I don't mind this at all. Oh god, this is a lot of Wisps, though. Alright, activate the measure against Wisps. Activate it! No, the. They all went for the fucking beetles! No! <laughs> A lot of scrappers on the field. This is our measure against wisps right here. It's just getting the drop on him. Okay, uh, stun grenade for sure. Stick bomb right after, sure. Die, 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 die. Thank you, that's the one I really wanted done. Right, let's get out of here. This is not gonna go well. Okay, balls is clear out. That one was to be expected. It's surviving all the wisps without a repulsion plate after the boss that I'm more so worried about. Okay, okay, okay. Beetle Guard is taking care of it. Beetle Bro is taking care of it. 
Let's go. Missed, motherfucker. Quack, 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 quack. Ah! Gotcha. Woo! Okay. Beetle Bro is coming through here. I actually, like, don't even mind him. Normally, you know, getting the Beetle Bro is, uh, not exactly the greatest recipe for success in the world. But you know what? You're all taken. Fantastic. We got like a gasoline or something that'll take care of most of our wisp issues. Did I get unlucky and get a wisp only pin event? No, okay, there's a beetle here. <laughs> I was really worried for a second. Normally I'm like wisp only pin event? Fucking great. As long as I have like one repulsion shield, I'm fine, but repulsion shield less double saw blade multi. Uh, Again, not not the greatest recipe for success in the world. Hey, here you are. I go up for sure. And sprint speed right after. All right, that helps with our movement speed issues a lot. It's like all I can do to you right now. Oh, you fucked up. <laughs> All you had to do was stay out of my reach. Ah, delicate watch, whatever. I'm, I'm not a big fan of delicate watch on double saw blade multi because I find that he just boosts them too fast. Because double saw blade multi is very much so a tank and get health back type of, uh, type of thing. It's not easy to, uh... Why can't I think? It's not easy to just go around unscathed. Usually when I'm double saw blade multi, it's just my healing can outpace everything. And I generally have just the highest damage taken you've ever seen by the end of the game. Alright, Harvester Sack. It's a good item. Okay. Death Mar. And we can get a shuriken here, which will greatly help us deal with wisps. Especially ones that are like right above us that we can't just jump up to. There we go. Shuriken. And now I can fight wisps. Alright. Who wants a piece of double saw blade multi? Yeah. 
Yeah, buddy. <laughs> oh, I love Double Sonic Bouncy. He's so much fun. Uh, gasoline. I know it's not great. Oh, you know what? Oh, repulsion plate's more important. I didn't notice it was there. Yeah, now I have, like, no fear of wisps. Cool! The biggest threat to this to this build is gone now. Oh, hey, look! It's the thing that wouldn't appear last time. A fucking equipment. A good one, too. Now I kind of wish I picked up that gasoline. And Repulsion Plate is still, like, the priority. Ooh, more glasses. Alright. Oh, shit, there was no Focus Crystal in there. Man, lots of painful, tough choices. Today. Hey, there's our gasoline. Cool, we have something to proc our forgive me please with. Hello there, Beetle Queen! I hope you don't mind me just, you know, melting through your health, but... Thank you! ATG, let's fucking go! <laughs> the thing about double saw blades is that the saw blades have a slight pull effect, where whenever you hit something, it kind of pulls you into the target. And when you have double saw blades, the pull effect is so strong that you can actually just stick to flying to large flying targets. So as long as I hit the bottom of a tentacle, I can go all the way up to the main body of a wandering vagrant and just stay there. Quite convenient, actually. Alright. And Sawblade Multi is like the only way I ever play Multi because it's just the only way I find him fun. Because you can go the whole, like, pure. You can go the whole uh, double rebar. But, I don't know, I kind of feel like it just isn't strong. I mean, I know it is, but like it doesn't feel strong when I use it. And then when you use double nail gun, it feels like all you're doing is just shooting things. I, I, I like the aspect of running around and hitting stuff. You know, call it the Dark Souls player within me. Alright. Let's see here. Oops. There we go. That's right. I have shurikens. Remember to use them. <laughs> that is our anti wisp button. Dude, Beetlebro is actually like really helpful. <laughs> Which is not often that you get to say that about Beetlebro. 145 for the healing chest. Gotcha. And what's in our shipping request? Hell yeah, more stunner day. Oh, that's that's our buddy. Okay. Die, die. Yep, thank you. All right, now we can go for that healing chest. Oh, I I'm, I I had a whole bunch of uh, hobo feathers in the last run. I forgot we don't have them anymore. Alright, Power Elixir. That's not gonna last long. Alright. Couple barnacles on the bottom side over there. We'll have to keep those in mind. Repulsion Plate Frontier. That could be very, very tempting, given the kind of build that I'm running. Oh, oh god, that is a void touch clay templar. Run away. No, we don't want anything to do with that. No, thank you, no sir. Nothing over there, there never is. Eh. There we go. There we go. He like 
walked right past us without noticing. It's really weird. As long as we can start hitting him, then we can perma stun him. There we go. die for my sake. Thank you very much. One more of you guys. What the fuck? Is it that beetle? It's, it's this beetle, isn't it? No, where? It's like under the fucking... Oh, well, it's dead. I don't know what killed it, but it wasn't me. I'll take it, though. Whatever. Alright. Large chest. Oh, and sh I can't take this without ruining my power elixir. Oh, it's okay. I have two of them. That's Who gives a shit? Uh, we're gonna take the monster tooth. Also, why am I going this way? I've already looped around this way. I have enough cash to pay for a, good, for a couple more items. Hello there. More sun grenade. I don't mind that at all, honestly. Chrono Bobble. I do have a death mark in my inventory, so that's one step closer. Now what's in you, good try shop? Uh, yeah, we're gonna want the go off. Without a doubt. Right, here's our teleporter. But there's still more to be seen. So we shall pass it by for now. Oh, well that was a happy accident. Hey, more fireworks! I will never say no to more fireworks. Fireworks are fun. Uh, yeah, that works. Alright. PSG, alright, whatever. I'll take a PSG. Duck right under you. God damn it. <laughs> oh, I can't fucking hit him. Beetle Guard's dead. He's gonna come back though. Alright, there's nothing else here. Let's go to the teleporter. Oh, and we're gonna die here. Oh, god damn it, that Dune Strider didn't die. Bit of a close call, but hey. What is this game if not a close call every other second?
And now it's trying to send out the whisper. But it's okay because I have, you know, a single shuriken. any tri-tips, which is problematic. Why do I keep getting fucking sirens call, man? I swear to god. We're not in a good location. I need the wandering vagrant to come closer to the ground. Before it's really safe for me to try to take it on. Here we go. This works. That's why I needed it closer to the gun. Because the vacuum is not surefire. It does let go after a while. Now I have some cash. Focus crystal planner. Ooh. And a tri-tip dagger. Good vines. I did lose a goat. Oh. Kinda worth it though. Bring it on, homeboy. Oh, I overshot. <laughs> alright, alright. I'm gonna end up fighting the Alien Worship Unit anyways, aren't I? Ooh! Alien Head! Oh, that's useless. Man, I got really excited there. And it game gives me a fucking Alien Head on Multi. What am I going to do with that? Goodbye. Teleporter's in a bit of an interesting spot. Oh, that was accidental, actually. But, alright, Aloy Worship Unit, let's fucking go. Bring it on. I am so gonna die. God damn it. Yeah, this is not gonna go well. <laughs> I am- it's because I'm sprinting, that's why. Mm, I can't fucking reach! Yeah, this is not gonna go well. Stuck to him. Come on, come on. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. I don't know how high up we are, it doesn't matter. Just get the movement right, so you stick to him. Yeah, alright. 
Happiest map. God fucking damn it. Two useless reds. Alright, let's go. This is surprisingly lax. Where's the other one? There you are. Ah, there we go. Boss taken care of. If nothing else, multi saw blades definitely has the damage to go above. It's just not always easy to do so with the mobility and sometimes needing to reach tough items. Fusion! Oh, I missed. <laughs> I missed Pig Tan. Uh oh. Oh god, I do not have much space here, and there's a lot of elite larva. And there's just a, a lot of tough enemies for somebody who doesn't have very much space. Okay, don't get watch broken. Make it! Go, 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 go. Oh! <laughs> what shot me? Fucking fast contraption. Oh! Man. <laughs> Ooh. 